Hi, Ari, it's Travis here, and welcome back to our adventures in New World. Last episode, we met Giacomo, and he had his plan stolen by the Corrupted. So he went out, and we defeated the Corrupted, and we brought his plans back. And in return, he gave us some furniture for our future home, and told us the importance of owning a home in Eternum. So, he was the, he was the white, right guy for us to meet, because that is currently what we are trying to do. Hunt 10 turkeys. I guess we'll pick that. 140 aged wood. So we'll pick that up too. And uh, do we have oil on us? I don't think so. So yeah, maybe we'll pick up some PvP quests today. I think we're done with all of the the quests. We are strongest or the side quests. Let us endeavor to bring victory to so the I think it's time... Actually, we already have some in progress. They're all elites, though. Maybe we'll go down and fight those elites. I don't know what we need to do for that, though. We've had these quests for quite some time. Maybe we'll go north and do these. And then we have one down here. And these are our PvP quests. We have to find items. Kind of out of each other's way. One's to the north and one's to the south. So I think we'll go to the north today. And maybe we'll collect some aged wood from uh, the mature trees. We have a little bit. So I'll put that away. The item cannot be transferred. Oh, wow. We clearly have too much stuff in our... Um... We have too much stuff. So we're going to have to figure out a way to get rid of this stuff. Or we're going to have to go to a new town. And we have a lot of gems, which is good. And there's our starting house furniture. So we'll throw that in there. And that's it. Yeah, we're at full capacity. It's kind of rough. Maybe we'll have to make some some tools and, you know, use it for leveling. Do that next episode, though. I don't really feel like crafting today. All right, so let's get out into the world, and we will do some town board quests today, and we'll chop as much wood as we can. I think we need, like, over 100 H wood. So we'll keep an eye out for the mature trees. There's one. <laughs> looks like <laughs> almost looked like we hit a home run there. There we go. We have 50 wood right now. Let's see if we can do that to this guy. Batter up. I wonder if they added that. I don't remember them getting hit that hard. Might be new. Who knows? Yeah, let's see where we gotta go. We gotta go north. Probably gonna fight some pirates today. Get a little bit of XP. Chop some trees along the way. And yeah, turkeys. We gotta hunt turkeys. I wonder if we need to collect our turkey. We need two turkeys. Yeah! Probably need to skin them. Assume we need to collect ten poultry. Where'd that other turkey go? Is that him over there? That's a wolf. Let's see what it's like to one-shot a wolf. It's not that bad. I kind of like the zombies. The zombies get, like, blasted into the air. Alright, well, let's keep on moving north. I think we took the wrong fork in the road. We gotta go to this fork over here. Let's 
see if we can blast. Let's see what happens in this guy. <laughs> yeah, they just get dropped. <laughs> One shining stuff is kind of fun. I wonder if we can group them up and then do the big. Bring him over here. No! God, I wanted to get like the double. The one shot double. Oh wow, he survived. Alright, let's keep on going north. Hopefully we find some more turkeys. We need to hunt some more of those turkeys down. We need nine more. It's a mature tree. Yeah. And it looks like our axe is going to be broken soon. So that's good because that means we need to make a new one. And I think we have the iron to do it. And that'll get rid of some inventory in our stash. That's another good thing about having a house, right? Like, it gives us more storage space. Where do we get there? Soft wood? This, what's this? Soft wood tree sap used in crafting to apply a bonus of focus and dexterity. That's cool. Never knew what that was. Oh, we've been here before. I remember the first time I came here. I got chased down for over 30 minutes. And I think we've done this quest. We've got to search ch chests for weapon oil. Is that what we got to do? We need five buckles here. And then over here we need one measuring vessel at the Gray Mist. Okay. Get over there. Well, we're already here. So I wonder if it's in this chest. We can't go in the water, right? We go up here. looking for again? Oh yeah, we already got it. Okay, so we just gotta go over here now. And then get the... the five things that we need in the forge. It's cool looking fire. Let's see if I can one-shot with that. Wow. Hatchet, it's hard. They don't get knocked as far, though. Let's compare. What do we get one shot? Yeah, a hatchet hits pretty hard. Let's see if this. Oh, wow. It's weird. You would think like a wind up with the great axe would do way more damage. Oh, they both dodged it. The guy was sitting down. Oh, wow. You got it pretty hard. Her own firebomb blew her up. Dash over here. There you go. More provisions.
Yeah, I think I might just have to buy a medium house. Like a regular house. I know I want to wait. For level 30, but that's just going to take so long. Like, I'll probably be, like, level 50 by then. And, like, that means I'll have to level here for a very long time. And Monarch Bluffs is, um... It's not, it's not a bad place to level, but I don't get a lot of XP here. I get way more XP in other areas. Oh, it's powered up. Yeah. Oh, that was nice. See if we can find some crates down here. Alright, so one more uh, buckle to go. And then we will be done here at this pirate cove. It's not like there's anything up here. All right, so let's get out of here. Level 22 syndicate member up there. Wonder if we can fight him. We can at least help him out. He has PvP off! <laughs> at least he swung at me. Okay, here we go. So we're heading south. I don't know which way we should go. Like, how are we gonna get... It's like the best way to go around. Should we go all the way... I guess down and then over this way? Yeah, it's probably the best. But yeah, we'll probably buy just a medium house. That's probably what we're gonna go for. I don't know when we'll do it, but we can already purchase it. And it would be good. But the thing is, we miss out on that extra five grand. But then we get, but we get the storage space earlier and a place to teleport to. I think for the the let's play, it's better because then I can, you know, go to different lands. Because I don't want to bore the crap out of you guys. Just like, <laughs> all right, guys, we're in Monarch Bluffs for the fiftieth time. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah, we got to go to other places. We're gonna go to other places, we're gonna do side quests, because I think side quests are kind of cool to do, because I would assume not a lot of people do them. And it would be cool to learn more about all of the provinces here in Eternum. So I think we'll focus more on that, and we'll get a house. Yeah, I'll probably be getting a house soon. And we'll just forego the, the the 5k it's not a big deal it's only it's only gold in a game but I will tell you something if I was uh, if I was if, if I was playing you know I would probably wait like knowing me 
the way I, how I play games, I would most likely wait and farm it out. Because, I don't know, I'm just like that. It's hard to say no to a deal. <laughs> but I think it's more fun for the Let's Play if I... And, and for me, too. If I go out and do the side quests and, you know, just learn more about the lore of the game and all that cool stuff. Because grinding is, is a little boring after a while. Like, I'm not a... I'm not a big fan of it. Especially as I've gotten older. I'm not really, like, as much of a fan of grinding in MMOs as I used to. Used to be. I, I don't think I've ever been a fan, but... It's only so much I'm, down, like, willing to put up with. The funny thing is, there isn't even a, there, in the Monarch Bluffs. There's three homes next to the inn. One's, uh, the, I think, the one in the middle is worth ten, and the other two on the side are worth twenty, and they're literally the same, same home. I always found that kind of interesting. I think that's the one we'll most likely purchase. These guys. And this is another thing, too. Like, a lot of the mobs here are just such a low level. But the thing is, down here, I think we're going to eventually do this. I want to do these. I think it would be fun to do the elites. But they're actually pretty a challenge. Last time I was there, I uh, almost died a bunch of times. So I think we'll be heading down there to actually try that, for that quest eventually. Or pretty soon, actually. So we're pretty much here. We just gotta go to this ancient area. Okay, so this is where we want to be. We have to look for weapon oil? Is that true? Precision tool. Yeah, we're looking for five precision tools. Yeah, I'm interested to see what, their, what the other provinces are like. It would be cool to go up to um, to this area, Weaver's Fen. I think Weaver's Fen's probably a lot of a lot of fun and an interesting place. We've got a couple of side quests there. I kind of like Weaver's Fen.
Everybody's just surviving over there. <laughs> You know, it's a really cool zone, too. This one up here. Even scale, Evan Scale Reach. I think that's going to be a real fun place to level. There's a 54 over there. A lot of Syndicate out today. You gotta watch out for that. I think we're getting a little bit off track here. We need to find... Couple more box it of boxes. We can loot that? I think we just looted it, didn't we? No. Just the area looks similar. Oh yeah, we gotta remember to keep farming these mature trees. I wonder what he's farming over there. My cat's hungry. <laughs> cats are uh, pretty loud when they're hungry, I'll tell you that much. Sure do like to meow. They let you know. He's just farming boulders. Wow. I wonder what he needs all that for. Maybe it's like a, a daily or something like that. He's literally just hitting them one time and they blow up. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's nice. When he left me an iron vein. It's very kind of him. Maybe he just didn't see it, but I don't know. I have a feeling he might have just left it for me. You could probably one-shot these two. He's a very good pick. So we should have enough wood. Keep farming it until. Might as well. Next episode we are going to be clearing up our stash. I think we might buy a house. Might be the might be that time. our inventory right now. Oh, we have enough. We have a lot of space. Where are these stashes, man? I'm looking for some more tools. I can't seem to find them. We're kind of running away from the area. There's one. I wonder if this will work. See if this counts. Yeah, got a tool from there. Nice. And we just need one more. Guess we'll just keep on going down the ancient path. Oh, we're in Windsward now. I wonder if it'll still count if we find a chest here in Windsward. We actually need to come here to do to turn in a quest. Let up here. See what we can find. Not much. Assume we can go inside somewhere. Oh, there it is. Jackpot. Let's see if we can finish the quest here.
Okay, so clearly Wind's Word is a little too far. I assume that would be the case. So we'll start heading back to where we came from. Look, we found a turkey. Hopefully we can catch him. So that's two turkeys. We got a poultry thigh from that one. Not a lot of chests around here. It's kind of... It's hard to tell where the, the chests are because everything just looks like a broken...